According to 51 World, there are different application stages for Digital Twin. The first stage is the ability to restore the scene, which is also the foundation of all expansion capabilities or interactive experiences. As the business becomes more in-depth or the functions are expanded, an inaccurate or unrealistic scene can cause many unexpected problems, resulting in an unsatisfactory user experience or inability to meet delivery requirements. Therefore, we believe that a digital twin world that accurately restores reality, whether it is from the perspective of current project demonstrations, the first impression of customers, or the future integration of the metaverse, realistic scenes are more competitive and have more potential value compared to cartoon or artistic scenes. In the second stage, when the scene has been restored according to the 1 1 reality, the value of the digital twin can be gradually added and experienced. Why is this? If a scene is just a scene, even if it is beautifully done, it has no real industrial value, it is just a CGI or a promotional CG video. One of the values of digital twins is that after you restore the scene at 1 1, it can be fused with all the real-time data in reality. For example, we often hear about things like passenger flow, or the hierarchical display of building information in buildings, or the energy consumption heat map of an entire region, or security path tracking in residential areas or buildings. These things all have data in real life, and this data can be accurately reflected on this platform, which is also helpful for people who cannot understand the data and can see the real situation more directly. After the first two stages, our virtual scene basically remains in static or what feedbacks the computer can send to us. After we connect to industries like industrial ports, we find that customers are more concerned about being able to control the entire production line or process from an office or a central operations center. This requires real-time data-driven. That allows the real world and virtual world to be synchronized with actions or movements. The things seen in this video, such as the beam bridge or gantry crane, or all the containers and the traffic, are all real-time, just like playing a game. As long as you turn it on here, it will turn on in real life on the other side. 51 World has always believed that digital twins, and even the metaverse, are based on reality and higher than reality. Therefore we hope to use digital twin visualization to reversely influence the reality and make the real world a more efficient and better place. Finally, at the fourth stage, the current data-driven ability allows us to review the past and control the present. But in fact, as a person or a human nature, we hope to know what the future is like. We very much hope to know what I am doing in an hour, what I am doing in a year, and even what I am doing for the rest of my life. The ultimate form of digital twins will inevitably be towards simulation. For example, we often hear about autonomous driving, pedestrian simulation or traffic flow simulation in our daily lives. Once the data reach certain volume, it will become very valuable for simulation. Once road data or driving data reaches a certain volume, it can be used in the simulation test for autonomous driving. Once campus data reaches a certain volume, the campus can operate automatically. When city data reaches a certain volume, it can also help decision makers predict situations like natural disasters, future planning, accidents, etc. so as to make the city a better and safer place. The same effort goes to the metaverse. 51 World is dedicated to bringing true value to people than just allowing people to look around in the metaverse's space.